えー、とまず政府の発表に関して、えー、政府はこの地元民の被爆に関して、えー、1ミリシーベルト以上被爆したで除染が必要だとなレベルであるとこういうふうに言ってますでこれは大変深刻な、えー、状況なんですがえー、御用学者とか、それから評論家は、えー、レントゲン撮影数,数回分に過ぎないと、こういう非常に楽観的な発言を行ってますね。で、これは私はまあもちろん素人なんですけど、レントゲンというのは一瞬、放射線が体の中を通り過ぎるだけで、えー、除染が必要なこの放射線、えー、物質がその体に付着して除染が必要な状況であるということは全くレベルの違う話だと思います、はいはい、そのセシウムとか要素とかそういうその放射性物質が体についている,いる限りはずっと被爆しているわけですから全くレベルの違う話だと思うんですね。はい The question. Please short. えー、もっと結論的に言いますと、えー、今その、福島原発は非常に危機的な状況を迎えていると思うんですが、えー、このまま放置するとどんどんこの放射性物質が空中に拡散していくという状況になると思うんです。でえー、最終的な判断を下す段階にもうすでに来てるんじゃないかと例えばあのチェルノブイルのようにセメントで封じ込めてしまうとかそういう状況になっているのではないかというふうに思いますがどうでしょうか。Okay. Um... A quick summary.、Uh, the, in regard to the two explosions that have occurred at this、uh, nuclear power plant,、uh, the government has announced that、uh, some of the people、uh, in the surrounding areas were exposed to ra radiation. They have said that the radiation levels that they were exposed to、uh, were、uh, over one milliliter,、uh, milli. milli Millisievert, excuse me.、Uh, and uh, th they say how also that、uh, this is a level that、uh, requires that they be de decontaminated.、Uh, I think this is a very, very serious situation. However,、uh, when we watch television or、uh, listen to other news reports,、uh, we have、um, academics and、uh, Uh, critics or commentators who I believe are very close to the government,、uh, who are very、um, protective of the government, and they simply dismiss this、uh, level by saying it's very similar to the kind of radiation levels that you would get when you were taking, you're getting an x ray. However,、uh, I'm only an amateur, I don't know about these things, but it seems to me that when you are exposed to an x ray, it's only for a few, you know, for an instant, whereas,、uh, and you do not need some kind of a decontamination process、uh, that you have to undergo. Therefore, I think this is a very, very serious and different matter、uh, completely. You're Uh, not only exposed to、um, certain kinds of,、uh, you're exposed to a wide variety of radioactive elements such as cesium and iodine, etc.、Uh, therefore, I believe that this is a very, very serious situation that we're facing in Fukushima,、uh, and more and more radioactive、uh, materials are being、uh, released into the air.、Uh, Isn't this time、uh, where another policy,、uh, perhaps,、uh, for example, you had a seven day kind of special policy that was taken with、uh, Chernobyl, isn't this time for another、uh, more serious approach to be taken? It's all 被爆等に関しては私は専門家ではありません。Like、saying, しかしながらおっしゃるように放射線を浴びるということと放射性物質が付着してそれからずっと被爆することは全然違います。But、um, as you've pointed out,、uh, there is a fundamental difference being, be, between being instantaneously or just for a moment being exposed to radiation rays and, on the other hand, to have this radioactive material cling to your body, to your clothes, etc., and to be exposed to these materials for a long time. ですから、えー、瞬間、瞬時値、瞬間値ではなくて、どれだけ時間。浴びているかというのが問題になります。In other words,、uh, it is not、uh, the momentary uh, uh, level uh, uh, of exposure levels that you are interested in, but rather over time, how long you are exposed to materials that is、uh, very crucial. そういう観点から
、えー、レントゲンとの比較するとか、そういう形を言うのは非常に、えー、慎重に考えなければいけない。Uh, therefore, I believe、uh, any comments、uh, that equate these kinds of radiation exposures uh, to uh, X-rays uh, is, uh, should be made with great caution. 例えば、レントゲンを3回浴びた分だと仮にします。For example,、uh, let's say that you have、um, X rays three times. 何も問題ないときにレントゲンを同じところを3回浴びせる年間,年間ですね、3回浴びるような人はいません。Uh, unless there is a special reason,、uh, there is no person、uh, alive that would expose the same part of their body uh, to uh, X rays、uh, three times a year. それは、えー、レントゲンを浴びればそれだけリスクを上げることになるからです。In other words, everyone understands that、uh, every time you expose yourself to X-rays, you are level, raising the level of risk. レントゲンを受けるのは何らかの、えー、病気があり得る心配があって、その病気を発見するためにだったらやむを得ずやるのがレントゲンです。In other words, no one、uh, elects、uh, voluntarily to undergo X-rays just because they wish to.、Um, they are probably、uh, worrying about a possible disease or some kind of an injury, and they want to find the cause of this、uh, disease or injury, and that's why they expose themselves to this risk. たとえ少ない量の放射線であっても、それを無意味に浴びることは、癌等のリスクを上げることになります。Uh, even if it is a small amount of radiation, uh, radiation uh, any kind of radiation exposure does、uh, have an incremental effect,、uh, incremental, incrementally increases your、uh, chances of、uh, getting cancer. ですから、こう、えー、慎重にですね、あの、線量がどうなってるか、で、避難はどうするかというのは、先手先手でやる必要があると、私は思います。Uh, therefore, I believe again、uh, that、uh, these kinds of comments should be made with a great caution,、uh, with not simply Comparing two very different things, but studying in more detail what kind of radiation exposure over what time period, etc., needs to be、um, explained more carefully. I'd like to make sure that I <coughs> understand correctly. Can you introduce yourself?、Hmm? 